Hello everyone, and welcome back guys to another video of Blender. And today guys, I'm going to show you here how to create the simple animation and make the cylinder move. Okay, so I'm going to show you this animation real quick. So you see it's very simple, and basically the cylinder just turns, rotates, and bends. So let's go ahead and actually save this, and open a new startup file. So let's go ahead and delete the square, the cube, and add a cylinder, or whatever um, shape you want. So go ahead here. And just, and just make this thing pretty long. Okay. You want to turn on X-ray and add an armature. Okay. Do we add the armature? Okay. So you can see here, we can see the armature. And let's and just let's go, go ahead and scale, and scale this scale thing. thing. Nope, not the cylinder. Do that. Take this armature and scale this thing. Until it's about the size of the cylinder. That's perfect. Now you want to go into edit mode by pressing tab. And select the armature. Now subdivide it. I'm going to subdivide, subdivide it about, about five, five times. times. So that so gives you six gives parts. Six, parts. Six, six different six sections. sections. So right so now, right if, now you're if you're trying to bend, bend it, 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 doesn't it doesn't work. work. You see that it doesn't, doesn't work, work at all? It's, it's not parent. parent. So you have, so to, you have go to go to object mode, mode. Select, select the cylinder, the cylinder first, first, and shift select the bone. And now press control P, and press... Set pairing set two, two with automatic, automatic weights. weights. So now, so now, if you go to pose mode, mode, mode you, see, you see it can, it can move, move, but it's, it's not, not how you expect, expect it. it. So you so want you to want undo, undo, go to object, object mode, mode, and select, and select, select the, cylinder. the cylinder. Now you want to press, press, well, go well, to, to edit mode, mode, and press control R, R, and add a bunch of loop cuts. So just, just keep on adding, adding, adding loop cuts. Loop cuts. I often I add, add a lot. lot. However, However many, many you want. You want. Okay, that's not how I want it. Oh, what's ringing? Something's ringing here. I don't know if you guys can hear it. Okay, so... Um, Let's move it down here. It doesn't have to be even, although for my other one, I did make it even. So usually, um, add the, the um, loop cut in the center, so where you just had the two, just had the loop cuts. But I think that's good. So if you select this, uh, Go to check mode, select that, pose mode, you see it rotates. But of course, it's not pair anymore. So we're gonna go back to object mode. Actually, I'll just undo that. Select that first, shift select, control P with automatic weights. Now, if you go to pose mode, see, it works like that. Okay, so you can see it's not really even, so that's why you see there's this little ring of something. But you, I encourage you to make it even, the loop cuts. Okay, so now we're actually going to... Let's close. I think I charged it. Wait a second. But you want to... Oh man, it doesn't work. Alright, I'm just gonna charge this thing real quick. Alright. 
Okay, so, so you want to want go to, to object, object mode, mode, select the bones. So now we're gonna add more, um, more bones, kind of, except in a different way. So go to this or this um person kind of tab and press B bone. So now you can see here it's just this big bone. Okay, so now you want to go to pose mode. And you can see there's these, these different sections. So these are the actually armature. So now you want to go to this bone kind of tab, and it says segments. The highest you can go to is 32. So now you can see here there's a 32 different sections, layers, in this bone. You can see, yeah, see it? Okay, so um, basically just want to do that for every, well, that's what I'm going to do, um, every single segment here. You can choose however many you want. I mean, 32 will make this cylinder very bendy. So it's going to be pretty fast. Okay. So now if we select this and bend it, look. See, there's a lot of, it's more bendy and all that stuff. And if we, like, select this, you press R, Z, and, like, 200, you see here it's, like, bending ridiculously. So if we turn off X-ray, that looks really ridiculous. But it's, that's how bendy it is. How flexible it is. So basically, just play around with it. Um, really, there's, oh, there's no limitations. So let's go Z, negative, 200. All right. So you see, just you know, rotate all over. No. Can look at that. Like, look at that. I mean, it looks so cool. So just play around and have fun. So anyways, this will be the end of this episode. See you next time.